The tools required for the 2200 series end drive belt change are four and five millimeter Allen wrenches. First, disconnect the power to the conveyor. Locate the belt tensioning end indicated with the label and collapse the tail by loosening the tailplate screws on both sides of the conveyor and pushing the head plate assembly inward. For conveyors on stands, remove the mounting brackets from one side of the conveyor. For wider and longer conveyors, a temporary support may be required. Then, remove the belt from the frame. Temporarily reattach the stand mounting bracket. Repeat the process at each stand location until the belt is completely removed. If replacing the spindle, after loosening the head plate fastening screws, remove the idler tail from the conveyor. Replace the belt by temporarily removing and reattaching the stand brackets. Repeat the process at each stand location until the belt is on the conveyor. To tension the conveyor, using a 5mm Allen wrench, locate the rack and pinion access hole. Rotate the pinion gear to extend the tail to the initial tension mark. If the tail does not extend, check that the tailplate screws are loose and that you are rotating the pinion gear in the proper direction to extend the racks. Be sure to maintain constant pressure on the Allen wrench turning the pinion gear until at least one screw is tight on each tailplate. This will ensure the tail is square to the frame. Tighten all remaining screws.